All right, in this video, I'm going to show you how to find your VST3s um, in case Ableton can't find them. You look to um, refresh and everything to find plugins. So um, this is where you can find the, um, the VST3s. Okay, so, oh yeah, by the way, this is on, this is on Windows, Windows computers. So you go to local disk, program files, and then you go to common files. And that's where um, common files is going to be like, like if you have other sounds and like other forms of like VSTs and other things you um, purchased, like Steinberg products and stuff like that. Um, yeah, they got their VS2, VST2s in there and everything, but common files and the program files, not the 32-bit, um, not the um, times 86. You know, you got the program file files times 86. You go to the regular one, which is a 64-bit folder in Windows. So... Yeah, common file, and then there's a folder called VST3, and here are, here are all the VST, VST3 files. So this is where you find them in case Ableton can um, automatically restore them, or you don't know where they are. Um, this video um, solves that, so I hope that helped. And in the description, I'm going to put a video in the description box to actually help you on find VST tools and everything and to put it right in proper way and install on them. So until next time, subscribe, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see y'all later. Peace.